believe that anything, anything that you set your heart and mind to can happen. But the Savior has to walk into the room. The atmosphere has to be set. How many of you believe that anything, anything that you set your heart and mind to can happen? How many of you believe that anything, Anything that you set your heart and mind to can happen. You have to allow him to have a welcome, open invitation into your home, into your life, into your heart. And oh, when he gets there, oh, when he shows up and shows out, anything can happen. But I can't stress enough that we cannot request the demonstration of the power of God unless we demonstrate our faith in him. Oh, hear me now. We cannot request the demonstration of his power because we know he's powerful until we demonstrate as his people the faith that we have in him. Your faith is what fuels your future. Warning, 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 warning. Hebrews 11 and 6 reminds us, and without faith, it's impossible. It's impossible to please God. And those that come to him must know that he exists. We must know that he's real. And those that earnestly seek him will be rewarded. Your reward is tied to your faith, God's people. Oh, it's tied to your faith. Who has faith on today? that what you've been desiring for will manifest. I declare
declare over your life that you're healed. Right now. Okay, maybe this side. Because he's here right now, I declare peace over your life now. difference between speak and declare speak means you just say it you're kind of subtle about it but when you declare you boast you praise you proclaim you throw out in the atmosphere oh god oh god i declare healing right now i declare peace right now I declare riches right now. I declare prosperity right now. I declare it and believe that it's so right now. I speak into the atmosphere. Whatever tries to form to prevent my praise won't work because he's here. Oh God, I thank you. I thank you. Thank you. 